right guys, we're gonna do a little evening ride today and we're headed to Moto Social. We've got that R18 bagger right there and we're rolling with some homies on proper cafe racers. <laughs> bagger right there the r18 bagger giving it some beans at a light <laughs> of course we got a sliver through la traffic here in the middle of rush hour. Oh God, I miss riding this thing. <laughs> it just makes me feel so alive. I just listen to that boxer sound just bounce off these walls. <laughs> What a rude awakening for uh, this neighborhood right here. <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta take the residential areas just to avoid LA traffic. Man, we are with some proper machines. You know you guys do that too. Shut up. There's gonna be this food truck, or rather van, that's gonna be serving tea. And it's called Uncle Rico's Van. <laughs> and that was an ode to uh, Napoleon Dynamite. What does this button do? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Man, it's even traffic on the canyon. We've got the BMW R18 bagger right in front of us shredding. <laughs> Had a blast reviewing that bike. Surprisingly, this bike instills a lot of confidence. It absorbs the bumps very nicely. So easy to turn in. And I just love the sound of that boxer engine when you're coming out of corner exit. Listen to that. Oh, beautiful. If you guys haven't seen it, I'm gonna link that video up on the top right of your screen. Check it out. Yeah, get it, Mike. <laughs> Oh man, look at that view, you guys. It doesn't feel too bad around the corners, though. No, but it doesn't slow down like my adventure. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's really comfortable. It, seems, it turns in really well. It stays planted. Um, you gotta remember that the lower RPMs, I'm used to running higher, but this thing was to live down low. Oh yeah. And I gotta remember it doesn't have shift assist. Right. Did you hear the chirp? I did, yeah. But I'm used to it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a nice night. Is nice. This is perfect weather. Yeah, you look good on that thing, man. I don't know if I should represent that thing at all. <laughs> <laughs> this is the nice thing when it gets a little chilly with these boxers. Yeah. Could even do this. Oh, yeah, I'm nice and warm right now. Oh, wait, I have heated grips. Next time we all should cycle to bike night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We might get there faster. This is a good road. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah. I 
I love it when the temperature gets cooler because the boxer engine just sounds phenomenal. So I don't normally ride at night. I used to a lot, but couldn't miss out on this moto social event. And this is what I miss about riding at night. Look at that. You can see the city lights at the bottom of the canyon. That is just gorgeous. While riding at night certainly isn't the most safest because you're just uh, not as visible to the rest of the drivers out there. There's just a smell in the air and different sensation you get from riding during the day. And it's awesome. If you live in LA and you're commuting on a motorcycle, this is certainly the best way around. You know, these old school incandescent non-LED lights actually uh, work pretty well, surprisingly. No cornering headlights here, but it does the job. And here comes the traffic. Can he do it? Yes, he can. But that's all it takes. Yeah. Fun little night cruise. Get a shot of the boys here. <laughs> I had to. I, I just had to. Looks like Mickey's working hard. <laughs> Mike from West Valley Cycles uh, ended up taking it because I didn't want to. I didn't want to drive it in traffic. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good seeing you. That was awesome. Got to kick it with a couple of friends, met a few subscribers. If you went up to me and you're watching this, sorry I didn't get to spend enough time with you, ask some questions and just kind of chat a little bit. Had a lot going on filming and talking to several people at the same time. It's a bit difficult, so my bad. <laughs> 
How about this? Hit me up on Instagram and we'll go for a ride. Back cycle is a really cool shop. Check them out. I'm going to leave the link in the description below. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed today's little night ride. I'll catch you on the next one. And as always, be sure to keep those side sets up. Peace!